In Egypt's western desert, 500 miles south of Cairo, six million solar panels bask in the hot sun. This is Benban, one of the largest solar plants in the world. It's a project Mohamed Amer is proud to be a part of. His job has taken him all over the world, but this is the first time he's worked on something this big in his home country. Well, I've been working in energy all my life. When I heard about this project, I decided to come back uh, and support the SCATIC in building this project in Egypt. SCATIC Solar is one of dozens of international companies that develop the site. The power sector is going through a tremendous amount of changes. Egypt is part of this change, and uh, that's the reason the Egyptian government has put an ambitious plan to diversify the energy mix. Egypt's goal is to have renewables make up 20% of its energy mix within two years. Benban is part of the equation. The site sends 1.5 gigawatts of energy to the national grid, enough to power a million homes. We call this area of the world as the sun belt. Uh, it has high radiance, clear skies, low humidity. It's all favorable weather conditions that makes you the maximum power you can get from a solar power plant. Omar is responsible for keeping the plant running. 24-7, it's online. The plant never shut down. Benban is providing more than energy. The plant is creating jobs and impacting the surrounding community. It's a huge project uh, providing hundreds of uh, work opportunities. The way you see people develop from um, locals to highly skilled engineers, technicians, technician assistants, this is a good start for them. Um, Mohammed and Omar are helping to bring Egypt one step closer to its renewable energy target. As the day draws to a close, these panels soak in the last rays of light, sending more electricity to power Egypt's energy transformation. Anna Stewart, CNN.